It's hot as shit in here, G. Yeah, it's bacon in this bitch. We got feet. Like oven in here. <laughs> Real. Right? You might have to open that up. Yeah, I know that big ass oven in here. But, they, but the only reason I don't like opening it, they said it should be getting stuck. Oh, shit. I don't want to fuck with it. It's popping though, man. Beyonce Wilder, Andrew Ruiz, they, they have a recent back and forth. Uh, Andy Ruiz said he wants 50 50 in a rematch clause or no fight. Yeah. Deontay Wilder said he's out of his motherfucking mind. Yeah. Ooh, what's your thoughts on that? Oh, I mean, that's a, that, is a, that is a good matchup, but Wilder is the, the cash cow in that situation. Mm. So I say 60 40 would be cool. I mean, but Andy Ruiz, like I said again, business, he just aiming high. He aiming high so that when, you know what I mean, if they talk him down, that it could be something that he could live with. You know it seem, I mean? seems like Wilder already has a, a deal in place with Joshua. Right. For about December, Joshua was fighting Dillian White. Right. And, you know, they, they fighting in Saudi Arabia. Right. Big bread. Right. You said Dillian White and Joshua? No, Dillian White and, and Joshua was fighting, I think, August 12th. Oh, yeah, and yeah, Wilder, yeah, December. Yeah, Wilder, Joshua, if they both get past their opponents, well, they fight in December and January. Well, what that mean is they just trying to find a dancing partner for Wilder. Mm. And in a situation like this shit, I wouldn't even want to fight Ruiz because he don't model, he don't model uh, Joshua. I would try to find somebody that model him. I mean, they, they can give me that size and that style. You know what I'm saying? Mm. When you fighting a guy like Ruiz, that's a, that's a way different fight than fighting a guy like Joshua. So since they scheduled for December, I would try to fight somebody similar size to, uh, that makes sense. to Joshua. And that might be what Maybe like the guy that just beat Adam Kanaki, somebody like that. What, Kanaki for, for uh, Wilder? No, I'm saying the guy that just beat Adam Kanaki. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Like He's him. around uh, Joshua's side. Yeah, guy like him. What's that, Italian kid? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Guy like him would be a good one. I mean, Joe Cusimano, I think his name yeah, is. Guy like Dubois, somebody. You know what I mean? Somebody. What does that mean? Somebody. If this doesn't happen and Andy Ruiz sticks to his guns, yeah. is that a dunk? No, because he he taking a big risk. When you fucking with Wilder, man, you fucking with chances of getting knocked out, higher chances. A lot of people know they go. It's a chance of them getting clipped. Fucking with Wilder, just like Helena's. You know what I'm saying Helena's knew what it was. You know what I mean? He didn't think he didn't think it would happen in the first round, but he. He took a chance, you know what I'm saying? And, that, and that, it got ugly for him. So, you know what I mean? That's what that's what you're trying to uh, campaign for more money for because the chance of you getting clipped might fuck around be your last fight. You fucking with a Wilder. As far as Wilder goes, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I know every fighter risks their life when they get in the ring. Yeah. But when getting in there with really big punches, how high is that risk? When you fuck with Wilder, you fucking with Russian roulette. You know what I'm saying? You putting the bullet in the chamber and you taking the shot. You know what I'm saying? He might miss, but if he hits you, that's the fuck it. I mean, that's really, that's as close as I can get. You know what I mean? They're telling you what it is. Even though, even though Fury beat him, still put Fury down. He's not, easy. He not easy to fuck with. He can hurt you bad.